Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Welcome if you're new. Make sure to like, subscribe, and let's get right into the video. Here's what my nails looking like. They're really looking bad. <laughs> like I damaged them accidentally so bad. So like this one does not look good at all. So let's start some nail prep. I'm gonna take my cuticle pusher and just push back the cuticle. And I'm doing this really gently. Also, I'm working with my non-dominant hand. Now I will be using my flame whip. I think I never mentioned it before, but I'm no professional, so I just do stuff my way, how I taught myself. And now we'll be using my round cuticle bit. And now I'll be dusting off the excess for a minute. I'll be using my cuticle my press and cut off all the dead skin around it and next I will be using my sanding band and just gently remove anything that's left and also take the shine away And then I will be taking my nail clippers and just cut off some of them. Now I will be using my nail file and just move the edges from the nail. I'm going for an almond shape, I think, today. So I sized out all my nail tips. I will be using my nail glue. Make sure to file the nail tips if they don't fit 100%. Okay, and now I will be cleaning them on. Here are the nail tips all glued on. And I will be taking my nail cutter and cut down some of them. And I'm going for an almond, like I mentioned earlier, so I'll be taking my nail off and just hold the nail. Alright, I think I like this shape. I'm gonna be taking the shine away and kind of like blend the nail tip into the natural nail and you want to make sure not to file your natural nail just the tip all right and then I will be doing this to all of the other ones and I'll be back okay so this is what the nails are looking like after Take the shine away and reshape them. Now I will be using some nail prep from Mia Secret. Next, I will be going in with some nail primer from Mia Secret. And then I will be applying some base coat from Model 1, just a thin layer. And you only have to do that on the natural nail, but I like to do it on the tip as well. Then I cure after this for 30 seconds in my nail rub. And I remove the sticky layer with my wipe. That's what the nails are looking like. Now I will be using my powder from a cart. 
and of course AC and stuff, I will be using my dampen dish that I got off from Shein, and for my soap solution I will be using 91% alcohol, for my brush I will be using the one from Waterworks, also I'm gonna get this here, let me just put it in, squeeze the poly gel on, coming in really handy, really hard to get out because it's almost empty. And I'll just start adding the poly gel in place. I will be doing full cover nails. The only thing I don't like about this poly gel is that you get like a lot of air bubbles in here. Um, and that happens like almost every time. And what I usually do is I'm just taking my tweezers and just like pop them like this and then just cut it again. And now we'll be adding another layer and build the apex. I'm trying to get really close to the cuticle. I don't know if because my poly gel is almost empty that there's so many bubbles that this is like so annoying. <laughs> And I'll be cleaning for 60 seconds. That's what the nails are looking like so far. And um, let's get reshaping. I'm gonna get my dust collector. Now 
and I will be using my sanding bun. I'm just off the nail. So here are the nails after they've been shaped, buffed and fine. And let's get to the nail art. What we're gonna need is white nail polish from all ones and a black one that I'm gonna be using from Beatles. Alright, just putting some on my plate. And I will be using a brush. And first I will be doing some French tips. For the nail art I will be doing a Sukuna design. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, Sukuna is an enemy. Here are the nails. I gotta do a lot of cleaning up. Okay, I'm just gonna try my best to just clean inside, make it look like a circle. I think I like it like this, so I'm gonna keep it. I end up taking off the dot in the middle because it's kind of off-centered. So I'm just gonna do a new dot more in the middle, just like that. I think that's good. For my middle finger, I'm gonna be doing a triangle. At least I'm gonna try. I'm gonna start cleaning up from the corners to make it nice and crisp. Good. I forgot to record, but anyways, that's how far I got. Now we'll be applying some top coat. Now I will be applying some cuticle oil. And here's what the nails are looking like. 
I think these turned out so cute. Let me know what you guys think. And thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you next time. Bye. Thank you.